Freddy here. Welcome to another video. Um, I know I've been MIA for the past two months, I think. I hope you can forgive me. I had a lot of school and a lot of work, but I'm back now. And uh, this is my birthday look tutorial. I wanted to look like me as a magical unicorn. Today we're gonna do something a bit different. I have my birthday the 30th of July and uh, I wanted to create with you a birthday look. I also have a lot of new stuff that I want to show you guys and uh, some of them is um, tart. I got my hands on them. also have a new background as you can tell. So for my birthday look I wanted to do a lot of my favorites. I wanted to show you some new stuff as well because I got my hands on uh, some of the lipsticks from Wet n Wild. It's the Mega Last Liquid Katsu. This is in uh, Nudie Patootie. I'm gonna use the uh, Tarte Shape Tape as my eyelid primer, uh, mostly because I think the makeup lasts so much longer when you're wearing this. And then I'm gonna take one of my favorite brushes for concealer and just blend it out a bit. One of my lovely palettes I made it myself. All of these are from Coastal Scents. These two are from Essence. It's their um, must-haves. This contour is from Too Faced. It's their chocolate soleil. This is from Coastal Scents as well. And these two are from Colourpop. I'm just gonna take this one for setting the eye area. And today we're gonna play around with some colors. I think we're gonna go in like the blue, green, purple scheme of colors because that's my favorite. And then I'm just gonna go in with this one. And then the other eye. There you go. I really love those shadows. They're really pigmented and um, for one dollar I couldn't really ask for much. So I'm gonna go on. I think we're gonna take that uh, purpley color and then uh, blend it. I think we need some darkness, don't we? Or some... Oomph. So I'm gonna take just a little bit of this dark purpley color and just put it in the crease. And then I just want to layer some of this gorgeous blue green shade on top. I think this is done better with the fingers. the eyes. Next up, the face. So first I'm gonna start out with the Hangover Primer from Too Faced. It's one of my favorites. I told you I was gonna use the Tarte Rainforest of the Sea foundation and I have been using this once and it really worked for me. Um, I really loved it. It stayed on for 12 plus hours and I danced all night and it was amazing, so, um, but this is a bit too dark for me, I don't know if you can tell that. So I have my favorite white mixer with me. It's the Manic Panic Dream Tone in Virgin. So for mixing my foundation with my white hair, we're gonna use a spatula and a place to put the foundation. You can also mix directly onto your face, so if I want to, I can make like a drop or two. And then, uh, put in the white mixer underneath and ju then just mix it. So I'm gonna take my trusted ELF Ultimate Blending Brush and then I'm just gonna take the last thing on the spatula and just put it on my face. So even though I have some imperfections, I don't want to color correct because the foundation is gonna take it all anyways. Oh, 
part show tip coming up. They're both a bit dark on me because I'm so light. But yeah, I'm gonna make it work. If I'm not blending out my concealer with my hands, I'm usually using this guy. So now I'm going in with powder, my favorite powder. I'm not gonna do the whole face because I like the feeling of uh, this foundation. It's almost set and I didn't even wait. <laughs> but yeah, I'm just gonna do like here and under the eyes. So to one of my favorite parts, contour. The only thing I wanted to try that was new today is the, um, is the Essence Luminous Matte Bronzer for lighter skin. It's called Sunshine. I think it's such a pretty color and I think it's gonna be like a great contour for my skin tone. Yeah, that's a good color. It's beautiful. And I'm also going to do a little bit of a little bit of nose contouring, just with the same color, different brush. And under the lips as well. So now I'm going to use my favorite blush. It's the Too Faced uh, Perfect Flush Blush in Sparkling Bellini. And it looks like this. It's really amazing and I think it blends well with almost uh, every highlighter I got. So I really love this one. And uh, now for highlighter. I have a few ones but I'm so pale so my go-to is always Jeffree Star. Skin Frost in Ice Cold. Oh yeah. Now I'm gonna fix my brows. For my brows, I'm gonna use the NYX Micro Brow Pencil in Ash Brown. Now I'm just gonna brush through them so it evens all the stuff out. And next I'm gonna use the uh, Essence Make Me Brow Brow Mascara in Soft Brownie Brow. My brows, even though they're quite light, they have their own life. So, what are we gonna do next? Uh, I think we're gonna finish up the uh, makeup for under the eyes. And we're gonna do the same as before, take the same colors and just put them under the eyes instead. So I'm gonna take a teeny tiny brush, the same that I used before, and just continue with the same colors under the eyes. That was the green color. The next one again is gonna be this one. So I think we're gonna, mm, no, we're gonna take this one first. And I'm gonna take this fine little brush and just take a little of the purpley shade we used before. And just try to blend like the edges. I know it's not a blending brush, it's just how I prefer it. We're just missing like the inner corner highlight and I'm gonna take my Jeffree Star again. 
then just a little on the brow bone. Now for the thing that can ruin my look the most, eyeliner. <laughs> I have the Gosh Extreme Liquid Gel Eyeliner in black. This is one of my favorites. Uh, this one stays on fairly good, but it's not waterproof. It's a liquid liner, but it has like a felt tip. So cross your fingers and I hope the next one is going to be just as good. That's fairly decent, I think. I can manage, at least. And now one of my favorite drugstore mascaras. It's the uh, Essence Lash Princess False Lash Effect. I'm not the one who used like a lot of fake lashes, but when I use some, it's probably like this. It's the Essence Lashes to Impress. It's called O3 Half Lashes. So I normally don't use the glue that comes with the lashes. I normally use Elure Lash Adhesive Latex Free Clear Glue. So I'm gonna use that again today. Oh God, now comes the hard part. Put on your lashes. I just need to blend the lashes a bit with a tiny bit more mascara. I normally use the lower lashes. like them a bit better, but I don't have any left. So, what are you gonna do? I just bought these new lipsticks. For this look, I'm going to choose this. I just wanted to try one out and see how the formula were. Let's see how it goes. And now for some setting spray. And as always, I'm using the uh, NYX Matte Finish long-lasting setting spray. Holds up all night, but this was the last one, so I need to buy some more, like, soon. I want to put some glitter in the corners of my eye, because I feel like glitter today. Do you know that feeling? I'm just gonna do like a couple. Just like, whoop, ah, tiny specks, and now they dropped. I dropped them. I'm gonna take some more. Ah, too much, there you go. Just like these tiny specks of glitter and I'm gonna use them in the corner of my eye. I have this like wax kind of pencil thingy to uh, keep them and then of course I have my glue. So let's see how to do this. I'm gonna look down at my mirror just because it's glue close to my eye. So Let's see how it goes. This is like what I do nail art with when I do nail art. But yeah, I wanted to feel like a sparkly unicorn and um, I hope I managed. I really love it and I hope you enjoyed my uh, birthday makeup video. So I hope you want to see some more of this. Hope you enjoyed. Bye.